Hey God, hey God, look at the time. My husband is not back from work. Hey God, what kind of condition is this? Eh? Oh, I'm getting worried. It's almost past 1 a.m. <laughs> what am I going to do? Ash, what am I going to do? Oh God, oh God, oh God. Oh, God. Oh, I can't do now. I need to do it now. God, please bring my husband back safe. Please bring my husband back safe. <laughs> Do you think you're coming from at this hour of the night to where you're coming from? Just start going back to where you're coming from because as far as, far as I'm concerned, you will not enter this house today. Go back to where you're coming from. But let me into the house first of all so that I can tell you why I'm coming home now. <laughs> you don't even know me. I don't even want to hear anything from you. Go back. I said just go back to where you're coming from. I don't, I'm not ready for any stress. Go back to where you're coming from. Whoever house it is that you're coming from, go back there. And you say you don't want to hear anything, you need to hear me out first. I don't want to listen to anything. I don't want to listen to anything from you. Just start going back. Oh my god, this woman. What I get in the, this woman will not even let me in so that I can tell you what the problem is. Do you know how worried I was about you? Look at the time. You're not home. Go back, go back, go back to where you're coming from. So you, so I can't even get now into my own house. Let me explain, madam. Eh? Let me explain. See, 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 I don't, I'm not even ready to hear whatever it is that you want to say. Okay, sorry now, sorry. Sorry. Even here, the English you are saying is sorry, sorry now, sorry. Is that the way, is that the right way to apologize? You have even just made things worse. Yeah, don't even talk to me. I don't even want to talk to you. I don't even want to see you. Stupid. Even if I apologize, nothing. Sorry. Yeah, wait a minute. I will tell You knew I was coming home to get into trouble with this one. What can I do? clean this place up. You know how I hate my kitchen being messed up. What is the meaning of this? Huh? Look at you. Every time the same story. What were you doing? Um, uh, I was sleeping. Sleeping, sleeping. sleeping always. Huh? Jesus Christ. Look at, look at the, the way the kitchen is dirty. Eh? And you know how much I hate dirty kitchens. Huh? What do you have to say about this? Sorry, mom. Sorry. Sorry. Mom, sorry. That's all you have to say about this. You know something? I want to tell you something very important okay. today that I never ever want you to forget in your life. Never in your okay. head. I just think in this life. Mm -hmm. I want to teach you okay. a very touching life lesson today. Whenever okay. in your life you want to apologize for something you did. For you to right. show that you are genuinely sorry about what you did. Let me tell you the first step. The first thing you need to do okay. is to say, I am sorry. Yes, okay. you apologize. Why are you sorry? Mm. And what are you going right. to do to change that mistake the next time? Or what are you going to do so that you don't make such a mistake again? Do you, are you understanding me? All right. So in okay. essence, what I say is, first thing you said, sorry, mama. No, saying sorry doesn't, it, it doesn't mean you're genuinely sorry. You have to say, I am sorry. It's more polite. It's more, it's much more, it shows deep regret for what you have done. Secondly, 
I am you gave the reason of why you are sorry and the reason why you were not able to do what you were supposed to do. For example, Mom, I am sorry I did not do the dishes. Why did you not do the dishes? You give me the reason why. And what are you going to do to remedy that situation the next time? My boy, do you understand me? Now, are you ready to apologize to me the right way? Yeah, I'm go ahead. sorry, mom. That I gave mm -hmm. you the sorry dishes. because actually I was feeling really tired and weak. That's the reason why I wasn't able to do the dishes. Next time, what are you going to do to remedy that situation? Next time, I will do my best to do my house chores before I go to rest. I'm really sorry about that, mom. I won't do it anymore. I won't do it again. Until so next time, remember this life lesson. Okay. This particular thing has caused many problems with many people in homes wow, today. Okay. It breaks homes, it breaks friendships, it has caused many, many misunderstandings okay. here. So, whatever you do, not now, even in future, whenever you find yourself, make sure to say, I'm sorry because give the reason why you are sorry and the reason what you are going to do to remedy that situation next time. That way it shows that you are really sorry and you wouldn't make such mistakes again, okay? So now, what do you do for me is to help me to wash this dishes. Okay, okay mom, look for the wash dishes. Okay. Right. My love. The only woman that got made for me. Why are you angry at me? Don't talk to me. Why? Say you shouldn't talk to me. I'm so pissed right now. You won't talk to me? Okay, okay, alright. Look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry I came home late. You know yourself, I normally don't do like this. So if it happened today, baby, you should understand that there is a reason for this. I don't normally come home late. So obviously, understand that if, some, if something like this happens, there is a reasonable explanation. So now, I'm sorry I came home late. Actually, we have an emergency meeting with the head office tomorrow. There were some reports my boss wanted me to complete before leaving. So everyone had to leave me there and I had to work on those documents. That's why I, I, I couldn't come home early. It's really urgent. I needed to balance some accounts and make sure everything is in order before the meeting with the head office as well as we are going to be controlled. That is why I came home late. If all that happened, why couldn't you call me to tell me that that was what happened? You knew fully well I was going to be so worried, yet you couldn't call me. Okay, look. Look at my phone. The battery is dead. I couldn't even make any calls. I couldn't even call to tell you that I will be coming home late because my phone battery died. No, really. Oh, your phone battery died. Why couldn't you use the phone of a colleague or anyone at work to call me? Just let me be. I was also caught up in the work that, that I couldn't even get someone for me. Next time in future, I'll try to write this wrong, okay? I will try to get someone's phone and with you as, so that you won't get worried like this. I'm sorry. So, like I said, I'm really very sorry. I didn't come home early. I gave you already the reason why I didn't come home early. And I'm going to do my best in future when this kind of situation occurs again. I'll try to find any remedy or any possible way that I can get to, to you. I'm sorry, just please forgive me, okay? Are we good? Sweetheart. Mm, you're still not talking to me. Come on, talk to me, please. Yeah, it's fine. It's okay now you've explained to me and I've understood you. So it's okay. I was just normally worried about you because you were in home 1 a.m. What do you expect me to, to, to do? Yeah, I was just being concerned, seriously. It's okay. Please don't do that next time again. I beg you. Trust me, trust me. I cross my heart. No, I won't do that anymore. How can I hurt my baby? I won't do that anymore. Just a minute. I got something for you. Oh, really? <laughs> Where is it? Ta-da! You know, you're belonging to have this, right? So I finally got it for you. I hope this can show you how truly sorry I am. Here you go. Have it. Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm so happy. Of course, I forgive you. Ooh, thank you. Thank you. But don't do that again, thinking that you you buy me something and, and get away with it. 
But thank you so much. I love it. Thank you. Hello everyone. Thank you so much for watching that video. I hope you understand the lesson behind this video. Now, when you apologize to somebody, make sure you give them the reason why you were sorry. And you make them to understand that you won't do that again. Because if you just tell someone sorry, it really doesn't make much of a difference. You need to say, I'm sorry I did this. Give them the reason why that happened and what you're going to do to remedy the situation. If not, you end up all your life saying sorry, sorry, sorry. And keep doing the same thing and never learning from the same mistakes you made. So let us learn to apologize to people the right way. This issue has caused so many problems in society. It has caused enmity between people. It has caused people to live in anger, bitterness and hatred. Now if we begin to say sorry the right way, then there's going to be a turnaround and you will see that the world is going to be a happier and a better place. I hope this inspires someone to learn how to say I'm sorry genuinely. So if you love my video, give this video a thumbs up, hit the red subscribe button down and please turn on your notification bell so that you get notified each time I post a video. Hope you enjoyed that video. God bless you. Stay blessed. And please don't forget to share. Bye.